All right, I'm back with the video. We're trying to do a video today. Um, let's just get right into it. Uh, let's talk about what's appropriate and not appropriate. Um, I'll tell you one thing, um, and then I don't think about it as legality or illegality, legal or illegal. Think of it as appropriate or inappropriate, okay? That's the biggest, most important thing. Look, in your life at some point, you're gonna go against the law at some point. All right. Um, you know what I mean? Somebody could bump your car and try to run away, and you react and, you know, let's say you kick their car or something. You know what I mean? Uh, which stuff like this happens all the time. Uh, you know, it's about appropriate and inappropriate. Do you know what I mean? Um, when you know that systemically something is supposed to be happening, which is not happening, there's an issue. All right, um, and you gotta understand that when somebody disrespects you inappropriately, well, there's a saying, people from glass houses shouldn't throw rocks or stones. Um, it, it's the same way. Somebody throws something inappropriate at you, you can't throw inappropriate back. Um, now, respecting, your, respecting people, uh, would you still respect somebody knowing that they were a pedophile or a potential pedophile or that they are aroused by children, for example, would you still respect that person? Because I would not, under any circumstance. Will I, will I bow down to somebody because they, they say they're superior to me? If they were, it might be a possibility, but it's not, okay? Um, I'm not buying down to some ugly, you know, shit-skinned person, to be very honest. Uh, I am not going to do that. That's very important to know. Um, moving on, um, you know, uh, yeah, that's all. That's really everything that, that that really should be said. You know what you're doing right. You know what you're doing wrong. There's nobody in this world that doesn't know what they're doing when they do something right or wrong. And even if you have an excuse, I mean, bar the excuse, it's still get, it's still going on and it's for a reason that it happened. You might say, dude, that was the last thing I wanted to do. The last thing I wanted to do was um, a run over a stop sign. That's the last thing I wanted to do, but you did it. So what are you trying to say? That you were the last pick to do that and nobody else would have done it so you ended up riding over the stop sign? Is that what you're saying? Right, because in that case, you did exactly, I mean, you don't really have an excuse or a pardon. I mean, you that's what you wanted to do and you did that. I never told any, like, man, when I robbed the bank, I told everybody I robbed the bank. That's it. I didn't tell everybody. Till today, I said I put my legal document, my court document on, on my YouTube channel. So it is what it is. Um, but moving on, you know, it's weird. It's like, it's like, let's say somebody's father works for me, okay? Somebody's father works for me let's say as a secretary or an accountant. He works under my company, I pay his salary, okay? I write off his salary. And his daughter, who will get slapped the shit out of and, and, and won't say anything about her dad and loves her dad, talks shit to me. There's a big issue. Anyways, I'm gonna end it right here.